Hey guys, what's going on? Today we're going to cover a couple things, common issues we encounter here in the shop. So let's get started. Number one would be device reading, no atomizer, atomizer short. First thing you'll do, check your coil. Make sure it's installed straight, screwed in snugly. It still isn't working, you might want to try a different coil. Check your 510 connection. Make sure it's clean, dry, free of debris. If your tank or RDA has an adjustable 510, like you see here, one of these. Make sure it's protruding. Make sure down in here is clean, dry. This side here, clean and dry. If you're using an RDA, make sure the posts, the screws in the post are screwed down tightly. Make sure the coils aren't touching the post. Kind of common sense stuff here. Now, if you have a leaky tank issue, check your coil. Coils, check these. If it's burnt, if it looks black, if it smells burnt, it's burnt. It's probably why it's leaking. Oh, let's see. Also, again, make sure it's screwed in snugly and it's sitting straight. You're also going to want to check the O-rings. So pull the coil out. Check and make sure the O-rings are in place. Make sure they're present. Uh, let's see. Um, adjust the wattage. Make sure you're running at at least the rec minimum recommended wattage for your coil. Like this one here, it's best between 120 watts and 180 watts. So you're going to want to keep it about 120 or more. Let's see, make sure you're running a thick enough juice for your style of tank. If you're running a sub-ohm tank, you kind of bare minimum want about 70-30 blend, 70 VG, 30 PG. Now, you could totally run a 90-10, it's up to you. Next issue, device not turning on. Seriously though, this is a common issue. We get asked about it a lot. Make sure you're trying to turn it on the correct way. Basically. All devices have the same power cycling method. It's five clicks on, five clicks off. It's pretty easy. If the device uses external batteries, make sure they're installed correctly. Positive to positive, negative to negative. Device. The device should be clearly marked, like you see down in there. If you can see down in there, one side's negative, one side's positive negative positive so that should resolve that issue next thing you're going to want to do is check your charger make sure your devices or your batteries are fully charging if they're not it could be your issue now if you are experiencing rough or harsh hits first and foremost check your coil if it's burnt if it's black it's going to make it a bad hit. It's going to be rough. If your coil's good, check. Try lowering the wattage on the device. You might be running it a little bit too high. And if all else fails, try lowering the nicotine level in your juice. Could just be too much nicotine. But should be it for the um, most common issues we deal with here. Y'all have a good one.